Hello and welcome back to the fourth episode of the Barcelona Master League. In this episode, we're kicking it off with a massive match against Atletico Madrid. We've been pretty bad this season, but we finally found some form in the last episode. In this episode, hopefully we can continue that and start to try to chase down Real Madrid at the summit. Atletico Madrid sits second, so it's a big game to kick off. Let's hope we don't lose and get smashed like we did against Real Madrid. Barat is through. Good save to Stegen. Why did Araujo just take him out? What are you, what are you doing? Nice, oh, Pedro. Nice, Rafinha. Here we go. Break on for Barcelona. Rafinha. Into Vahalovic. Great ball. Vahalovic. It's through the leg to the keeper. And Barcelona take the lead within 20 minutes. Our first shot of the game. Vahalovic puts it in the back of the net. It's the perfect start. Nice play. Here we go. Counter again for Barcelona. Look at the space. Can you play Victor? Good ball. Victor plays Torres. Can he dink it in to Vahalovic? Bro, really? Really? Pedro Poro picks it up. Back post. That's Torres with a free hitter. He has to score. He has to score that. That should be 2-0. What the? Why did he kick that instead of hitting it? Oh, my God. Nice ball, Victor. Can you find Bolde? Yes, he can. It's Bolde. Can he play it across? Unlucky. Halftime, 1-0 to Barcelona. Atletico have had a couple, like, half chances. Obviously, they had one good chance early on in the game, but we've been very dominant. The build-up play is good. We're playing very well. I'm happy with this. Good start to the day. Hopefully, we can see it out. Oh, really? Oh, what a skill. What, what skill that is. It's excellent. It's Vahalovic. No. Young. Can you find Bolde? Oh, what a ball. What a ball. Bro. Where's the pass, man? Like, where are my options there? No. Yamal picks it up. Great touch. Yamal still. Yamal still. Still going. It's Yamal. It's a great goal. It's 2-0 Barcelona. And Yamal scores a beautiful goal. The youngster fresh off the bench just goes with pace. And that should be three points in the bag. The perfect start to this episode. We've had a good performance. It's a good ball. It's a good ball. Griezmann, good save to Stegen. Clean sheet still here. Full time, Barcelona 2, Atletico Madrid. Nil. Oh my god, Vasquez loves it. A little bit too much, in my opinion. It's a great result to kickstart this episode. Hopefully, we should have caught them by a good amount of points. So we should be like four points behind them, maybe. But Real Madrid are going to be very difficult to bring back. I think they're 13 points clear. So this is it. Oh, 10 points clear. They must have just lost, which is perfect. And we're seven points by Villarreal, five points by Atletico Madrid. We're well and truly back in the race. All right, for our next match, we travel away to El Marea. This is our last game before the opening of January. And we've had moves already completed. So I'll show you those when they actually get confirmed. But let's end our first half of the season, kind of, with hopefully another victory. And our team has rotated a little bit today due to some um, players being tired and whatnot. And this is not the perfect start. Oh, okay. You're kidding me? So, yeah, that's not a good start at all. Nice for that, Gavi. Oh, my God. This game. Why did it change my player? That's just dumb. That's just dumb. Yep, good save. Jesus, come on. This has been a real bad start from us. Here we go. The chance to counter now. Torres. Victor, you're going to make that run on the inside. You are. Good ball. It's Victor for Barcelona. No, it's straight at him. Nice, Diong. What a tackle. Bahalovic. Plays Torres. Torres. Victor, back to Torres. Bahalovic. Bang. Oh, unlucky. That would have been quite the goal. Oh, my God. What, Diong? What the hell pass is that? Come on. Yamal. Bahalovic. Can you get there? Yes, Bahalovic. Yes, good strength. Bahalovic, good save. Seconds. No, there's no one there for a tap in. Yamal cuts in. Bahalovic on the quick turn. No, can't get it to anyone. Oh, it's still alive. Like, I mean, <laughs> I was sort of just the whole time waiting for someone to make a run because I like those little dinks in behind, but no one did. And then I was like, well, I'm um, tackled. Good first half. A little bit dodgy defensively this game. They've applied a lot of pressure, more than Atletico did, but going forward, we're good. It's got a score. Oh, what a ball. What a ball. Chance to Almedea. Oh, yes. Arejo. I love you, mate. I love you. Can you find Victor? Can you fight for it, Victor? Yes. Oh, he's so lucky. Caught at the edge. It's Gavi from distance. That is so unbelievably tame. Oh, my God. 
And we're there with the ball in. Fort. Fort's doing bloody 360s in the box, mate. This guy, I really don't like. Oh, my God. Nice. No, I shouldn't have bothered playing that. And I should have known it was going to be overhurt slightly. You find Olmo. Lovely ball. Olmo plays it across goal. And there's nobody. Absolutely nobody there. You find Fort. You can. It's a great ball. It's the youngster. Why would you shoot with your left? Shoot with your right far post, you buffoon. Because if you get on target, there's 100% a tap in available. That's so annoying. Nice, Vasquez. No way. He still has it. No. Oh, good save to Stegen. Oh, my God. We survived at the end. We should have won this game. We had the chances. Just weren't clinical today, which is unfortunate. Luckily for us, Real Madrid drew as well, so we didn't lose points against them, which is fine. And our first signing of our January transfer window is obviously Nico Williams. We tried to sign him in the summer, but unfortunately, he was just slightly too expensive. We just didn't have enough money. But now Nico Williams is here in January, and hopefully he can provide us with some quality on the wing. And for our second signing of January, we've got Rafael Leal, the Portuguese winger, as he was suggested in the comments. So he is here. We've signed them both, I think, for roughly about the same amount. Nico Williams and Leal for about 80 million or something like that. They're under 100k wage each, so that is all good. And Leal is here, and hopefully now we've got two extra wingers coming in, some real quality off the bench and starting. And obviously, because we're signing them, we will be trying to sell some players as well. But it all depends on whether offers come in, because obviously January is quite short. All right, here we are. Our first game with some new signings in the team. Away to Granada. And they're both on the bench. Nico Williams and Liao are both on the bench waiting to come on to make their mark for us. And the starting eleven is pretty settled. Obviously, that will change very quickly depending on how good the new signings are and who potentially leaves and who potentially comes in. Nice. Oh, my God, what a pass. Victor. He played Dion. Oh, my God, it's beautiful. Dion! No! Just wide. Unlucky. What a fantastic start to the game. Wow, I thought I had that. Are you kidding me? Nice win. God, he's so good. Can we set Rafinha away? Look at this. Look at this. Rafinha driving. Great run, Vahilovic. Great run. Back to... No way! No way you stuffed that pass up. Oh, that was to Torres. Oh, day. Into Torres. Torres. Yes, Valovic, it's in! The perfect start for Barcelona. He makes up for his mistake by slotting it home with the first shot of the day. Valovic gives us the lead. It's the perfect start. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Okay. Oh, he missed! Oh, I thought he scored. Oh, my God, the mistake. It's Valovic. No, he saves it. There's no one inside to tap it in. You find Torres. Nice from Torres. It's Torres deflected. It's in. It's 2-0. Oh, don't tell me he's going to be given as an own goal. Come on. Surely that was on target. 2-0 and we're cruising. That is not a good header for it. Not a good header, but Kunde sweeps it up. Beautifully done. We find Rafinha. Little bit over hit, but can Rafinha get there? He does. Beautiful from Rafinha. Is he going to go all the way? He may do. Rafinha still. No. Yep, that works. Rafinha slots it home. No, it's at the post and then he takes a touch. I cannot believe that. I can't believe that we haven't scored that. Halftime 2-0. It's been very dominant. Very good. Very dominant. I'm very happy. Look at that. Seven shots to zero. Look at that. We're cooking. Prime Barca is back, baby. You'll forget about Pep in no time. Counters on now for Barca. Look at this. 4v3. It's a 4v3. Bahalovic, I need, I need to make a move there. Good run. No way. Yep, yeah, that works. You piece of shit. You piece of shit. How did you save that? Rafinha. Oh, it's a bad ball to Torres, but it's fine. Torres picks it up beautifully. No. Oh, I can't. Like, the chip was shit because I thought he was going to go to ground. And then him just saving that's unreal. The subs are coming on. The new boys are on. Oh, my God. Why did... Why did it do that? Why, why did it change my play to Sagan? Why would it do... I'm wanting him to come out and just punch the ball or hit it or pick it up. And it changes me to him. So he doesn't do that. Yeah, that's that's pretty good, actually. Nice play. It's Ansu Fati. Great finish. And that's the game done. Nico Williams gets his first assist for Barcelona. And it's three points.
Also, we signed this youngster. We actually signed two youngsters. Two young center forwards to a 75 rated, both like 17 from the free agents, just because we had no strikers. So we signed them. We'll probably eventually sign another striker, but for now, they're sort of the bench players. And we gained points of Real Madrid. They drew again. The comeback's on. And we're also selling Martinez for 14.6 million to Union Berlin, I do believe. 70k wage as well, which is excellent. He is just not good enough. And our third signing of January is a new defensive midfielder. Now, De Jong's actually been playing quite well. He was really bad at the start, but he started to grow on me. I kind of like De Jong now. He's kind of playing well. But now we have another defensive mid. It allows De Jong to even play center mid if needed. Zubamendi is the new player from Real Sociedad. We signed him for 56 million, I do believe. He is earning in quite a lot 105k i think per week the most expensive wage so far that we've signed in january and now we're sort of broke we don't really have much money left so it all depends on how many players we can sell whether we can bring in some more players all right here we are our next match in la liga we play against Getafe at home and i'm full of confidence we've got a lot more quality off the bench as well which makes it a little bit easier for me to sort of you know not have to panic when we're playing ass because we do have quality off the bench oh, i'm pyro nice you deliver a ball. You can. Valovic. Ooh, what a fast start. Rafinha to Victor. It's beautiful. It's Victor for Barcelona. It's straight at him. I should have just tried to play it near. Valovic. Unlucky. Pedro Porro. No. Why did he? He's got to play that backwards, man. Oh, play Torres. What a ball from Pedri. It's Torres. Torres still. No, man. God, there's, there's never enough runners there. I can't play it across goal. Nice, Poro. Great ball. Valovic. No, why is... Why is he not a back post? Torres, that's your role, mate. You have to be back post there. Nice play. Valovic turns his man. It's Valovic. What? What do you mean he saved that? Oh, come on, man. That should be a goal. Poro. Rafinha. Yes, it's beautiful. Rafinha. I don't know why their keeper doesn't come out, but it's in. And Barca take the lead with three seconds over half time because there's no added time. So that's technically cheating. We'll take it. Half time, 1 0 Barcelona. We finally get our goal. And I'm happy now. It's been dominant. To Rafinha. Oh, that's not Rafinha. But now he can play it. Rafinha! Ooh, <laughs> weak foot. That was tragic. Rafinha. It's beautiful. It's Porro. Pedro, Porro, great strike. Just shoot the ball. Oh, my God. No such thing as first time finishes half the time, man. Porro. Tight angle. Oh, he's taken off me toes. Back to Yamal. Driving into the area. It's Yamal. It's a great finish. Fresh off the bench. Leal gets the assist. Yamal scores. And Barcelona make it too. And we're cruising to three more points. Yon picks it up. Can you find Victor? He probably could here. Victor, what a chance. Oh, my God, man. Oh, my God, no way. No way. I don't understand how we haven't scored that after that pass. I thought that'd be certain. Kunde's running in bloody... I don't know where he's going. Nico Williams. Oh, don't run it out, please. Thank you. Nico Williams using his pace. Beautiful. Good strength as well. It's Nico Williams. How is he catching me? How? I'm fresh off the bench, bro. What are you talking about? In a way, Pedri picks it up. Into Victor. Victor, what? Victor, what are you doing, man? Full time, 2 0. Barcelona cruise to victory. We should have scored more today. Kind of annoying, actually. Another dob. Look at that. Zero shots for Getafe, 10 shots for us. Comfortable. All right, another day, another match in La Liga. We're way to Cadiz. And Zubamendi is making his first ever start. So is Rafael Liao on the left hand side. We've got a rotated team for this game. Obviously, this is a couple of days after our last game. So we have a few tired bodies, but it's fine. Now we've got a little bit of depth. I'm not as unhappy having to rotate the team. He's got to be offside. He's got to be offside. He's got to be. What a save from Tostegan. And he's not offside. Okay. Drifting on the inside. Look at him go. Skips past one. Still going. Plays it wide. One, two. Rafinha. It's just a shit pass. Cole Will. Come on. Into Poro. It's beautiful. Poro dinks it in. Valovic. God, no one can score hitters of this team. Yeah, picks it up. Gavi, why did you stop that run? It was perfect. That was absolutely perfect. And he stops it. Oh, my God. One more Rafinha. No way. You don't run down the line, Cole Will. I'm not liking this youngster. He sucks. <laughs> okay, we're making subs. 
we could not create today. Obviously, new players sort of change things, you know, change the feel of the team. But he's coming off. I'll tell you right now. Victor's coming off. Ball's coming into the box. And it's in. Oh, bro. It's been a shocker. It has been shocking today. Shocking from everyone. Really bad. The, the front line is not linking at all. Nice ball to Victor. Oh, and then he runs it out, bro. Jesus Christ. I'm not telling you even to go forward there. Gavi. Oh, my God. Nah, bro. We've had a, we've had a shocker today. Can you find Valovic? Yes. Valovic. Oh, nah. That's not happening. That's not happening today. This is uh, this has been so bad. How have we not scored that? Oh, God. Here's your Aparo with the ball in. It's a good ball. Victor's... That, that, that's murder. He kicked me head, mate. Into Victor. Victor. There's to Rafinha. Rafinha! Oh, if it had gone to Rafinha first. He could have shot it with his left foot. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Bro. Okay. This is, this is not ideal. That's for sure. No way. We don't have the ball there. There's no... There's no way. Yes to Stegen. Like, bro, how do we not have position there? Like, come on. Lamal, you're fresh off the bench. You're not getting there. Are you kidding me, man? Is this a joke? Is this a joke, guys? Oh, Sagan, I thought you were just going to go for it. Oh, my God, bro. It's just been a stinker. We're just getting after the ride off as that. To Stegen's coming, so I don't try and contest. I just think he's going to win it. And then he just stops. He comes and then just stops. If you're coming, come. <laughs> Literally, if you're coming, come. You know? Fucking <laughs> you know, hell, bro. Oh, bro. It's been so bad. Oh, my God. That pass is horrendous. But Ford has had a great touch there. And it's in. We've scored straight away. No way, bro. Is it, off, is it own goal, is it? Own goal, I think it is. No way we score straight away. There's just, it's just... Come on, man. Seriously. Why would I pass to him? Oh, my God. That's lucky. Yes. No! Keep it alive! D hit the ball! What are you doing? Oh, it's just dumb. It's just dumb, bro. It's just dumb. Come on, keep it alive. Yes. Yes, good ball. Not. Oh, you've hit the shit out of it, man. Oh, God! Today's been annoying. Full time we lose. Deserved loss, man. That was horrendous. Horrendous performance. Seriously bad. All right, for our next game, Celta Vigo is our next victim, hopefully. Shocking game last time. I've got to bounce back with a win. Nice. Into Victor. Victor should be 101. Is 101. Slots at home. It has been such a difficult game. I honestly don't believe we have more than 30% possession after 25, 30 minutes. They have been so utterly good. It's, this might be one of the hardest games we've ever played. They've been so good with the ball. Like, I can't touch it. Oh, what a ball. What a ball. What a save. Whoa. Rafinha. That was insane. That was actually incredible. Nice ball as well. And it's got to be a tap in. Surely it is. It's 2-0. Now we're starting to play some football. Come on. This has been better. The last, once we scored, we started to play a bit better. Nice ball. Rafinha picks it up. Bahalovic gets there. Goes around his man as well. Can he find Rafinha? He can. It's Rafinha. Oh, he's, he's not laced that hard enough. Rafinha picks it up. Goes for goal. Is there someone to tap it in? No. We're not good enough at tapping it in, boys. Come on. Where's the poachers, man? Where's the instincts? Halftime 2 0, and we're cruising to victory. Look at that. 56% position. No shots, though. Rafa Benitez. You're not good enough, Matt. Rafinha picks it up. Thinks it over. It's Victor. How did he win that? Oh, come on. We play Nico Williams. I mean, that works. Oh, no, it doesn't. How have I not got around him? Um, hello, game? Uh, well, what is going on? Are you kidding me? Are you joking? Balovic, Liao, beautiful, Liao, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. That is a goal to be remembered for Barcelona. Fantastic finish, fantastic build-up play, 3-0. I've been struggling with Liao and Williams so far because they're sort of different players. You sort of, you know, they do different things in your system. I've got to get used to them, but I kind of like Liao up front, even though he sort of can play there, but not proficient there. Oh, give it away. I just kind of like him up there, to be honest. And that's full-time, 3-0 Barcelona. Liao gets his first goal for the club, and it's a comfortable victory. They were pretty good, though. With the ball, like, keeping the ball, they were good, but 
Obviously, they didn't try anything. All right, another game. We're still in good form. Only losing one so far this episode. We've played well. Valencia away from home. Liao gets a start up front. And Zubamendi is back in the midfield with Yamal on the right. Oh, and Olmo is playing as well. He hasn't played for ages. We don't really have a position for him. May just look to sell him because he's not a centre mid. He can't really play up front. He can't play on the wing. And we don't play cams, so he may be out the door. Yes, look at this. Liao's in. It's Leo for... No way you shot that with your right, bro. Go across with your left. Chance for Valencia. Good save to Stegen. I mean, that was supposed to be a longer pass, but it's fine. Look at this. It breaks. Look how it breaks. Yamal. Leo. Play line. Good play. Leo, can you cross it to the man, Victor? In the area, you can. Oh, man, that's good counter. No way. Yep, that works. Oh, my God. I thought that might have been given in a penalty. Can we counter? Yamal. Oh. Oh. I rate it. I rate the pass. You know what? That was that was a little bit different. And I I, I respect it. You know? Can I can I change to the guy who's there? Nah, not allowed. How the hell has that ever got through? How how? I th this game's crazy. And you've run it out! Okay. Okay. Let's yeah, let's stop all that shit. <laughs> Let's, let's not do that. Uh, I've not got out fast enough. And oh my god, he's missed a free header. Okay. This is just stupid. Let's not do stupid things again. Okay. Tick, tick, and you find Leo. Great ball. It's Leo. He's in again. For the second time. Oh my god, bro. Ah, that's shit. That's shit. Torres picks it up. Great position, Torres. Beautiful from Liao. Beautiful! Oh, it's a good save again, bro. Hard time, Nilo. We should be winning. Liao has had three very big opportunities. We've been wasteful today. Oh, can't touch the ball, man. No way. Dinks it in. What on? Can we can we keep the ball now? Good ball. Really good ball. Liao. Play Yamal. Yes. Yamal. Uh, can you beat him? I think you have. Yamal! Oh, far post. Ah, it's whatever. Rafinha cutting inside. Where's the runners? It's Williams. It's a great run from Williams. What a save! Oh my god. That is incredible keeping. Nice ball. Bolde. Here we go. This is the chance. Bolde. Yes! Yes! Come on! Liao's done it! In the 91st minute, he is the hero. He may have missed three big opportunities today. But he's made up for it. And Barcelona get the three points. Oh, fantastic. Bold, eh? Beautiful. I was so... I was like, who the hell do I pass to here? And luckily, Leo was in the perfect position and just slots it home. Three points. Come on. Full time, 1-0. Leo is the savior. Thank you. Good man, Leo. I mean, the collar's a bit broken. Um, yeah, <laughs> that looks a bit odd, but fair enough. In terms of the league table, Real Madrid have dropped a little bit. They're not even first now. Federico Madrid lead with 49. Real Madrid 48 with six points behind Real Madrid. Seven points behind Atletico. It's on. So we're going to be selling Ferran Torres for 71 million. He's been pretty decent with us, but with the signing of Liao, now he can go left wing. and got Nico Williams that can play left wing. You know, so many players come into the team. He's been good, but for 71 million, I mean, that's a player. That's a quality player we can bring in. And our fourth signing of the window is Darwin, Darwin Nunes. He is signed from Liverpool for 60 million. And he is our new striker because obviously we're playing a two-man system up front. We haven't had a striker really. We've got Liao who can play there. And he's been pretty good there. But now that Torres is gone, Liao can go onto the left where his natural position is. And now we have Nunes to score off the bench. And for our probably last signing, I would assume because the window is about to close and we're not going to have much time to sell and buy someone with that money. We've signed Kanate for our centre-backs. Now, obviously, Kunde and Arejo are brilliant. They are going to be our starters, but we do need that third centre-back that can step in when needed, and Kanate is going to be that man. 70 mil from Union Berlin. Yeah, yeah, this guy's worth 300, honestly. And we are accepting this bid for Ansu Fati to Manchester City. They signed both Fati and Torres for a combined amount of 130 mil. So we'll take that. Fatty, nowhere near good enough for this team. And here we are for our final game of the episode. The transfer window is done and dusted. We made a lot of signings. Five signings. Five first team signings, which is pretty impressive. And now it is time to see just how well we can do in the second half of the season. Liao is now going to be our starting left wing. 
after Torres and Fatty left. And obviously, Nunez and Canate fresh on the bench for the first time for Barcelona. Cut in. Nice, Rafinha. Rafinha! Too easy for the Brazilian king! Rafinha scores, and Barcelona take an early lead. It's a fantastic start. He's just, he is actually really good. I'm not going to lie. I really like Rafinha. I like him a lot more than Yamal. Yamal's still decent, but obviously he's 17. You know, he's going to grow a lot. But for right now, Rafinha is my starting right wing. And the problem is, is we're not in Europe, so we don't have so many games to need to rotate. You can blame me for that one. Liao cuts in. It's still Liao. It's still Liao. It's still Liao. What a goal. Liao scores. And Barcelona are just flying. We've built a super team here. I'm feeling really confident. Obviously, I don't know how the likes of Canate and, you know, Nunez will get on, but I'm liking Liao. Williams, I haven't got right yet, but he will 100% have an impact. If you didn't notice, I also gave Liao the number seven after Torres left because I felt like that was the most suitable number for him. Oh, that's falling straight to him at the edge. Oh, great. So Stegen's been excellent now as well. Everyone's just decided to play well. Remember when we couldn't do anything? Yeah. And the distant past. Half time, 2-0. Um, yeah, it's been pretty easy. I mean, we haven't done very well after the two goals. But other than that, we're cruising. Vahalovic! No, it's off the bar! Ah, I put too much power on it. Nice one, too. Rafinha, can he get there? He does. Cross it in! You you see the power bar! And he doesn't cross it. That's, I mean, what more am I supposed to do with that? Oh, Yamal gets there. Chance! Seconds, thirds, oh my god, bro. Nico Williams drives into the area. It's Nico Williams. Oh, yeah, that's that's horrific. That is horrific. I don't know what type of pass that is. Absolutely disgusting. Nunes' hair looks awful, bro. I'm not gonna lie. That pass was supposed to be a 45. Um, yeah, it works. We scored. Nunes gets his first in a Barcelona jersey. Really good ball. Oh my god, we survive again. Full time, 3 0. Comfortable win for Barcelona. Nunes gets his first for the club. And we're looking like the team. We're looking like a fantastic team. So, as we end this episode, it's four points separates us. And first place and second place, Atletico Madrid and Real Madrid were very much in the race. This would be one of the best comebacks to win a title ever. We were like, at one point, 15, 16 points off. We've really turned this around. That's going to be the end of this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. Like, subscribe if you did. And I'll see you boys in the next episode. <laughs>